Unit Two Projects. In this video, we are going to see Unit and Segment Segmentation Comparison. Introduction. Popular deep learning architectures for tasks involving semantic image segmentation include Unit and Segment. To support accurate localization and efficient feature extraction, Unit makes use of a U-shaped network with skip connections. The encoder-decoder structure used by Segnet, on the other hand, uses pixel-wise classification. Segnet focuses on efficiency and minimal memory usage, whereas Unit excels at accuracy and object delineation. In order to choose the best model for particular segmentation needs, this comparison aims to assess each model's strengths and weaknesses. Objective of the project: This project's goal is to assess how well the Unit Segnet GWO unit and GWO segment models perform at semantic image segmentation, particularly when applied to a fresh chest X-ray dataset. The project aims to evaluate each model's segmentation outputs and accuracy. In order to find the best model for this particular task, the project analyzes the results to identify which model produces the most precise and understandable segmentation results for chest X-ray images. Requirements. These are the requirements needed to execute this project: hardware requirements, operating system of Windows, processor of i5 and above, RAM of 4 GB and above, hard disk of 20 GB and above. Software requirements needed are Python IDE of Python 3.7 version. To execute this project, we have designed the following modules. The first module is upload test file. This module allows us to upload a chest X-ray image for segmentation. The input image will be processed by the segmentation models to obtain segmented outputs. The next module is run unit segmentation. In this module, the unit model performs semantic image segmentation on the uploaded chest X-ray. Unit is a convolutional neural network architecture that uses a U-shaped encoder-decoder design with skip connections. It is suitable for biomedical image segmentation tasks due to its ability to capture fine details and localize objects accurately. The third module is run segnet segmentation. The segnet model performs semantic image segmentation on the chest X-ray. Segnet is an encoder-decoder architecture that uses pixel-wise classification for segmentation. It aims to strike a balance between accuracy and memory efficiency, making it suitable for real-time applications. The fourth module is run GWO unit segmentation. This module involves running the GWO unit model on the uploaded chest X-ray. U GWO unit likely refers to combining the unit architecture with the Gray Wolf optimization algorithm. GWO is a nature-inspired optimization algorithm that imitates the hunting behavior of gray wolves. It is used here to fine-tune the unit model's parameters and improve its segmentation performance. The next module is run GWO segnet segmentation. Similar to the previous module, this module applies the GWO algorithm to optimize the segment model's parameters and enhance its segmentation accuracy on the chest X-ray data. The next module is Comparison Graph. The Comparison Graph module presents a visual representation of the segmentation performance of the different models, making it easier to compare their strengths and weaknesses. The next module is Unit and Segment Accuracy and Loss Graph. This module is dedicated to plotting the training and validation accuracy and loss curves for both the unit and segment models during their respective training processes. This visualization helps in understanding model convergence and potential overfitting. The last module is GWO unit and GWO segment graph. This module is dedicated to plotting the training and validation accuracy and loss curves for both the GWO unit and GWO segnet models during their respective training processes. This visualization helps in understanding model convergence and potential overfitting. Execution of the project To execute this project, first we have to open the code folder. This is the model folder in which I have .h file, pickle, numpy and json files which contain the algorithm information. These files can be loaded into the project code during runtime to utilize the trained models. This is the dataset folder in which I have training images and mask images of chest X-ray. 
so this is the test images folder these are python main code files this is the run.bat file instead of executing the project in command line interface we have created this windows batch file double click on run.bat file this graphical user interface will be open with this we are interacting with the program we have used tkinter library to create this graphical user interface now click on upload test file button these are the test images i have select any of these images i am selecting this image and click on open so it confirms that the image is loaded now click on run unit segmentation button so this is the original image and this is the segmented image by unit algorithm close this image and in the text box we can see the accuracy sensitivity specificity precision recall f score of unit algorithm now click on run segment segmentation button so we can see the original image and segmented image by segnet algorithm close this image and we can see the performance metrics of segnet algorithm in the text box now click on run gwo unit segmentation so this is the original image this is the segmented image close this and here we can see the performance metrics now click on run gwo segnet segmentation so in this we can see the original image and the segmented image this is the performance metrics of gwo segnet now click on comparison graph button so in this graph on x axis i have the names of all the algorithms and on y axis i have the performance metrics so we can see that gwo segnet is performing well when compared to other models close this graph now click on unit and segnet accuracy and loss graph so in this graph we can see unit and segnet training accuracy and loss graph where x axis represents epoch and y axis represents accuracy and loss values and we can see with each increasing epoch accuracy got increased for both algorithms and loss got decreased and here blue line is for segnet loss red line is for unit loss green line is for unit accuracy and yellow line is for segnet accuracy close this graph now click on gwo unit and gwo segnet graph so we can see gwo unit and gwo segnet training accuracy and loss graph where x axis represents epoch and y axis represents accuracy and loss values and we can see with each increasing epoch accuracy got increased for both algorithms and loss got decreased close this graph the conclusion here is the conclusion here is this project aimed to compare four deep learning segmentation models unit segnet gwo unit and gwo segnet on a fresh chest x-ray data set among them GWO segnet displayed the most encouraging outcomes outperforming the other models in terms of accuracy while segnet also did well unit lagged a little their performance was assessed for accuracy sensitivity specificity precision recall and f score which provides in, uh, insightful information this project advances medical image analysis which may help patients and healthcare workers Thank you for watching video. For more projects please visit our website www.trueprojects.in. For updates on latest project videos, please visit True Projects YouTube channel and subscribe.